but stay on topic here. If we don't make the deal, they get the nuke. If we don't go in and militarily make sure so you, they don't. So you're basically saying there would be war. There could be. But the better thing is to cut them off economically. And, and when you say that the Russians and the Chinese will, we don't know that for uh, sure. They, know, they, they were absolutely said But we, is what we know. We know what the Iranians have said. And we know that the last time the world did not take seriously the threats to Jews, six million of them died, Bill. And, and for us to pretend that these are just empty threats, I've seen this movie before. It does not end well. And America can do better than that. We didn't even get the four hostages out of uh, Iran. Last question. And, and I agree. We should have gotten the four hostages out and been a lot tougher in what we got on our side of the deal. Do you believe President Obama is a naive man or has ill intent in foreign policy? I think he is naive, especially when it comes to radical Islam. He won't even call it by its name. And I do not think he likes Israel. Now, he can say whatever he wants to, but he puts more pressure on Israel for someone building a bedroom onto a house in Judea or Samaria than he does on the Iranians who are trying to build a bomb, for God's sake. All right. Governor Huckabee, thanks.